so I'm gonna just start recording just so that we can see what I can always edit and trim the videos later. Sure. Alright folks. It's your boy Smithy Bo Jesus here with wires. As you can see, we're gonna go after the Ultra Knight. Ultra Knight, if you guys don't know, is on the Dreadnought. He's a big bit of naughty. And we're going to teach him to be nice. And hopefully he'll drop us an exotic engram in the process. So what you're going to do is run past where you'll see most of the Cabal fighting. Make your way down the hall. Oh! Mr. Marks! What up? What up? I don't know, but there's a whole lot of people here that I would not expect to be here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just put a dragon monster out and I'm gonna solve the situation with some authority. Cease and desist. What happened to you? How? head is gone now so we'll call that payback and retribution how's that all right folks yeah yeah it gives me a chance to switch out my weapons and get a three a coin all right folks so did you see that little opening we went through so when you get to where you can see this little like there we go what i know i've been here i showed the, you the sitar yeah the the Sithari is the one that actually showed us where to go for this. So if you guys want to know where it is, it's up here. You'll see a little pipe that you go through, like as if they had a bad air conditioning conduit, like somebody didn't know how to install this properly, and they didn't put any kind of, you know, ceiling tile over this. So you just jump through the opening that they shouldn't have left, but they did. And that'll let you into this little, like, control room with the little hologram of the ship here. Then what we'll do is we'll switch our weapons to something more effective at killing this Ultra Knight. Like, let, let's let's see this unbent tree, and we'll go ahead and pull out the Anton's rule. Anton's rule, yeah. We'll do the Anton's rule right now, and that'll let us pull out this here Galahorn. So this Galahorn is what we're going to go and greet the Ultra Knight with. Um, I'm going to pop a three a coin. If you guys don't know, I've had this explained to me. A three of coin, whenever you're going to defeat some ultra or big boss, you pop a three of coin and it improves your chances of getting an exotic. And exotics are what you want, folks. They're yellow. Apparently yellow is the style of this game. So we're going to go find wires, as you can see. He's up there a little ways. He's probably doing like an MC Hammer dance. Hammer time, hammer time, hammer time. He dropped an exotic engram. That's right, people. It worked. What silent screen? That's better. <laughs> I went to ins I went to inspect and I was like that's that doesn't really match with Mr. Wire's character right there. See everybody else looks all cool with their characters. That guy looks like I came out of like swap meet with a beetle on my arm. 
Dude, my guy, my, my character looks just like yours. Look at it. Wait, are you using... I use the same shader as you. Are you using the whore frost? Yep. That's... I have a dust walker cloak. I, that's all I have. I have two dust walker cloaks. I have a Child of Osiris chest piece and cloak. I was able to get this to be, what, tier, what is this, tier 11? I have uh, not I seen so. a calcium one in this room. Where should I be looking? Usually up. I think it's over here. If it's over here, then I, yeah, I got it. Alright, we're looking around for... Oh, is that it? Be it. No, blue. Calcify yeah, fragment. Over here. Yeah, I, yeah, I knew it was over here somewhere. Yeah, I got this one already. Yay! Calcified fragment. I don't know what I get for that. Is it like an upgrade? Uh, no, you use it to get um, an exotic. It's, it's for an exotic quest line. 